G'day everyone and welcome back to episode 28. This is an ongoing rebuild series of Movie World on the Gold Coast. Well, not really a rebuild series, just a little bit of a muck around that's now turned into a full-blown series of 28 episodes. Um, today I'm pretty much just tackling the Gotham City Hall. It's uh, just a little seating area um, outside of one of the burger shops that are in the park if you haven't been before. Um, I've spoken before about this place being my favourite place to get burgers from, even though most of the burgers are the same everywhere, but this this is the number one place I love just going and getting a nice good feed and just relaxing. So um, this piece ended up being very hard for me to figure out how to do as there's a lot of force perception within the piece. Um, and by that I mean just where you stand, this building looks very tall when it's not really. It's the statues that make it look taller than what it is and obviously the height. So it's obviously designed to hide the Superman escape behind it. But then also there used to be, I'm not sure whether it's still there, but there used to be a pathway which led um, um, from Main Street down the back. It used to be, I think it used to be like a like a Chinese sort of um, footpath from memory. I can't remember. I only remember doing it once as a kid. But um, you could walk back through there. You could walk along the side here and then it would bring you out back near the um, Arkham Asylum or before that the lethal weapon. So I do plan on recreating that whole backstage area. Probably not to the full extent as there's not really any pictures of what it looks like back there. So I might just do a little backstage, simple backstage area. Because as I said, I, I do see myself taking a lot of time with the... Um, um, Scooby-Doo Coaster and the Wild West Ball. So we're, I'm just trying to get get to the Scooby-Doo Coaster, then get to Wild West Falls as quick as I can, and then come back around to the other side and put the Police Academy stunt show and other stuff in there. So this building went through a couple of iterations, as you'll probably see. I had the basic idea of what I wanted to do and the sort of sizing so you'll see me moving around trying to work out whether it should be longer or bigger because I didn't want it to be just tucked away and hidden I wanted it to be something that you can when well obviously when I upload this you can download and recognize things in the park and know things in the park obviously I couldn't put the statues which you've probably already seen from the thumbnail or the start of the clip but um I'm, I'm really happy with how it turned out like it's it's really cool to sit back and just watch now so um, this is starting to trek along really really fast so it's I don't know when I'm gonna get around to finishing like everything but I've already drawn up a plan now for the Scooby-Doo coaster I'm planning on using another roller coaster which is a secret at the moment so you'll have to stay tuned for that but um, I've pretty much designed it as in They've shut down the ride. They've just said, hey, we're re-theming it. Um, well, not really just a re-theme, but they're gonna change the coaster track and put a new roller coaster in there in the same building. So, which is something which they would probably do in real life, trying to um, save more money and costs and then just get an indoor coaster. So at the moment, that's still in the drawing plans. I'm still trying to get the building finished and laid out like that as I I'd rather have the building done and gutted so that you can see what the building looks like completely empty and then in another video it will be building the coaster, building the scenery, building all that which I'm hoping doesn't take too long and if it starts to take too long I'll, I'll come back to it but other than that it's, it's, I'm so happy to nearly be done with just the city street pieces because it's, it's been so hard to recreate city pieces so now it's going to be great going into obviously the dc rivals not dc rivals what's it called is it like the villains area i'm not sure what it's called um and then obviously moving around to the wild west area so i do believe the wild west area will be easiest as um i've just completed another park in um something else that I'm trying to create that I'll obviously show everyone later so as you can see here 
I did like the gothic doors. I just thought trying to find a piece that I haven't really used anywhere else can look really cool. Um, obviously this is all just my own interpretation of what I believe this should look like. Like obviously it's not a recreation, but it is enough for you to be like, okay, if this park was set up in the movie world, but then also with Planet Coaster pieces, that it, it does make sense how things work. So I believe I got the general gist of it, as, as you'll see, obviously no statues, just the um, banners and stuff like that. Obviously that normally reads Gotham City Hall, but you know, as everyone knows, the text in this game is hard to use as it is, so it was just easier just to put that there and have it all finished up. So um, in the next episode, we have the, well, it's a sneak peek at the end, as you'll see. Um, showing what we do in the next episode, but then obviously, yeah, I'll release that showing the full build of that as well. So, this is just me finishing up here, trying to do the final touches. Um, as you see here, you've probably seen a couple times, I, I do like to create this as fast as I can and get the basic layout of what I want, and then after on, I'll go back in and rebuild it to like, I, I don't even know what the word is, but I'll just put extra details in it that will be cool for you to discover when you download the park, which I am hoping, like, not to another time frame, but it's, it's hard to, to work it out really. I'd say we're about, well, maybe more than 50% done now, as we're not doing the kids area, so that, that'll just be fenced off or just left as open biz. I think I might actually just leave that for you guys to recreate if you want. Um, also, if um, anyone has any other ideas of what sort of things I can do, I know I've got to do the Dirty Harry's Cafe and all that on the other side, but that's obviously when I come back around. So I'm planning on spending a lot of time on the Scooby-Doo Coaster and the Wild West Falls, and then, yeah, we'll just try to move on from there and fill in the little missing pieces, and then it'll just be going back and over and over and over, trying to fix up the backstage areas and stuff like that. Um, Someone did message me asking if I was going to do the car park. That's still sadly a no, as um, but I just I just feel like it wastes too much like energy already. When it's it's hard enough with work trying to get these out as frequently as I can. Like obviously I've been missing for two weeks and now I've come back and this is the second video straight away just to try and keep the series going. And then yeah, so I, I don't know. I'm, I'm glad to see, like, well, not glad, but I'm excited to see what you think, but yeah, that's the end of this episode. Have a great day. Check out one of these other videos, and um, yeah, as I said, have a great day. Sneak peek coming up right now, so check that out. Have a good one. See you next one.